everyone. Just wanted to show what uh, might be a good thing for people that are just starting in the uh, choppers and in the uh, Kiowa, the OH-58. Um, what I did that helped me a lot is I put a, a helicopter down on the pad. Uh, I took the mast off. I gave it 70% fuel. You can, you can take all that stuff off here. Um, you can take the weapons out too. It doesn't really matter. Um, gave it 70% fuel and then uh, went and flew it. And what you'll find is it's super, super light. It's very easy to um, to fly because it's so light. It doesn't have all the weapons and stuff on it. Oh, that was the other thing. I took the hard points off and all the weapons. So it's very, very easy to fly and a lot, a lot of fun. This back over here, about right there, my trim, and then slowly lift up. It's going to want to twist to the right. That missed. Super easy to fly. Not a lot of fun. Um, practice doing this. Just holding the hover. Um, doing some slow flight, things like that. Until you get the hang of it, and then after you do that, you can throw on the weapons and whatnot, and then go do all that. But I just found this was an easier way to learn. How the, how the chopper feels. I do it with the other ones as well. I was learning that this is by far one of the easier helicopters I think to fly. Um, I mean, it's super easy. I'm actually surprised. I thought it would be harder, which I'm glad it's not.
wires around here. Um, and they also use the, uh, the little They fly over the house all the time. I mean, I hear them all the time. Um, and you can hear them from a long ways away. Uh, working and pulling their maneuvers and the blades slap and everything. And it doesn't sound like a weed whacker with a muffler on it like that. That's just my observation. Um, and that they're already working on it, so it's not a big deal. They'll, they'll get it. It's just going to make the module really kind of even better. Um, I would highly recommend to someone if they're getting into choppers. I mean, this has, God, almost, probably more, a little more than maybe the Apache does, uh, as far as, like, reconnaissance stuff. It has the big mask on top, so you don't have to expose yourself. Um, it doesn't have the, uh, the radar guided stuff, or the data link, things like that. Um, it does have some neat features on it, which I haven't learned how to do. The mums, where you can download images from other other helicopters, other high highways, and also from drones in the area. That's kind of neat. Um, I don't know how handy it is or what you can do with it, but it is pretty cool. Um, and then you know you can buddy lays for people for batches. Uh, side in it, um, someone flying in, someone in the left seat doing the mast, and uh, doing some missions, um, so that's going to be coming pretty soon, and we're also going to do one in the uh, 15th the seat back seat, because I haven't done that yet, and I've been to, um, and then I got to learn the back seat in the infamous F4, so that'll be fun too, but anyway,
Roger. You have the controls. So this will be a very easy helicopter to if you're starting out the helicopters to fly to to be an easy guy thing. Very good launcher. Now if you want to wait until it's on sale, which I'm sure is going to take a while for it to be on sale. that can be fixed. I don't know if, it, if that's a thing that they can do or not. Um, yeah, I shouldn't say it's not fixed. It's not working. But it would be a cool feature if they could do that. Anyway, guys, that's it. If you want to get into choppers, this is the one to do. In my opinion, it's a great module. Looks fun. Looks great. A lot of fun to fly. So, hope that helped.